I'm always, opportunities never come knocking on my door, you know. Always got, got to go out and chase it. And you know, shit just happened, man. It's out of my reach. Some of it was self, myself, but most of it was not. It was just uh, either an accident here or issue there. And it's, it's life again, life happens. Even when they think it's over, oh, I thought it was over. You know, people don't know uh, what you go through in life and, and how hard it is. But one thing is, I'm, I'm not gonna quit. I'm gonna find a solution and I just keep giving excuses. That's, that's all you have is your mental state. Tell yourself that, you know, because I should have been done five times over. My thing was always, you know what, let me get back on, let me find a solution, let me move forward. Those were one of my strengths into not becoming that, you know, that type of athlete that was just out because of one issue, one thing. You see, you all know what I've been through, the madness, you know, the doubts and everything. They my fuel to this fire. He's originally from the Dominican Republic. He's the biggest, baddest bodybuilder in all of New York City. Here is Victor Martinez. They start the pain. Everything I do is like clockwork. It was, it was done. I mean, you gotta keep going, and uh, this is it. This is the outcome. Number nine, Victor Martinez. Number 22, Ronnie Coleman. And number 24, Gabe Just when you think you're there, you're not really there. But then you always got to know what's your challenge. And my challenge has always been me. I always wanted to beat me. I always wanted to beat the last me. Everybody's telling me you got it. You have it. I mean, I have Ronnie Coleman, big time Mr. Olympia. And Victor, you, you have this show. But, you know, I remember being backstage telling him, Ronnie, I grew up in the hood. You don't have nothing until you have it on your hands. So you don't have to settle for second, dog. You are number one. Don't allow these judges or anybody else to confuse you to believe that because they give you number two, that you're number two, man. You are number one. Believe that in their heart.
bottom but my aura like a frisbee Come down for what? I'm too busy being up Dedication is for steel And a little bit of luck Y'all a champion you for real Every coin, every field When you actually thought you paid your dues Lo and behold, it goes south and you get a horrible placing and it questions, did I not pay enough dues? You know, it's one of those things that it, it's done. It's done, move on, come in undeniable next time. I'm comfortable in that. Like the pain, like the suffering, in the end of it all, you reap the rewards. I never really lost it mentally. Physically, it might show, but my mind has not failed. I'm not gonna set myself up for failure. I'm gonna set myself up when I know I have it, when I know I've got it. Everybody has their own accomplishment, and I accomplished mine, which is coming back, not quitting, not giving up. Now me, it's all about how fast you get knocked down, how fast you can get up, and all I want to think of is how am I going to come back, the changes I'm going to make, thinking how strong I'm going to come in to fuel my drive. That's the shit that I aspire to be like one day, but to look like fit, that's the ultimate goal. I'm going to be there soon, maybe a couple years, but I'm going to fucking get there. Salute to my big inspiration, Victor Martinez. You had so many obstacles you had to overcome. The things that you had to overcome where others, that would have been career-ending stuff for other people, where you said, listen, I'm going to push through and I'm going to keep going. If there's work to be done, I'm the man for it. If there's suffering involved, you know, pain, I'm the man for it, you know? I will do it. Well, ain't no what to say is over. No complaints, I just tighten up my game. Every play they 